The mark of maturity is being able to admit when you're wrong. Yesterday, I jumped to the conclusion that this Wisconsin cop actually went ahead and planted drugs on a black man. After watching the body cam footage again, the second one, I found that the bag that they placed into the back seat was actually empty. So on that part, I was wrong. But in watching the body cam footage, you know what I did see? A passenger of a vehicle being patted down under false pretenses. The officer's initial idea was to go ahead and pat the guy down in search of weapons. Now, I've been to many a club and many a concert. So if you're searching me for weapons, that should be where the thing stops, right? How then is your search for weapons then become a right to be able to search the entire car? And since when is it okay to take out a passenger if this was for initially a traffic stop? All of the passengers were black. So while I may have been wrong and jumped to the conclusion that they planted drugs on the man, there are so many fucking things wrong with that goddamn stop that had they not been black would not have happened. Oh, and thank you for everyone who took the time to basically nitpick at that one thing and kind of disregard everything else I was saying, such as the fact that the criminalization of marijuana disproportionately affects black people and brown people. Y'all glossed the fuck over that and went straight for the corner cut baggie talking about how it was empty. Every one of y'all that sent me that body cam footage can't give me one good reason why the hell you would be arresting a passenger in a traffic stop. But like I said, I was wrong. But you can go on ahead and head over to the Marshall Project and see the myriad of cases in which I would not be. You know, so you can sleep at night. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Never been afraid to speak my mind. Oh no.